fact, Joe Girard, Mike, is playing his 150th collegiate game tonight <laughs> after four years at Syracuse. Hunter driving down the lane, off the backboard, and in. Into the corner, and that'll be a three in front of the Clemson bench. Middlebrook's got a piece of that one. NC State's on a 6-0 run, trying to increase that run, and they will. Morcel hit the deck and scored. Morcel with the kick out. Horn is way behind the line, and he rips the ropes for the pack. Just his eighth made three of the season for Jack Clark. Horn again, straight away, and he does it again. Just picked up his first personal foul. His shooting on point, straight away for three. And the pack. And Horn had a chance to tie the game in regulation last Saturday at Wake and missed the jumper. Sends it inside. Middlebrook's position, basket and foul. Confusion right there. There are three guys on that. It was supposed to be a double team. It was a triple team. Shefflin, the leading rebounder for the Tigers this season. Nine and a half per game is third in the ACC. Spin move and two. RJ Godfrey and the foul. The nifty move inside. Goes, takes the middle. It's a zone a little tougher to, to rebound out of. The former Tiger sends it out on the perimeter. Up top of the board. Godfrey had stolen right back. Burns drops it low. Great look by Burns. The Taylor. And there was a foul on the play as well. So Jaden Taylor. Burns found him. And he's going to the free throw line when we come back. Gerard. Bit of a mismatch a, here. Yeah, just a slight mismatch. Gerard lets it fly and knocks it down for three. Those three pointers cutting into the 10 point lead. Gerard gets it started straight away. Hunter. Free ball from Hunter. No, nothing that Burns could do on that play. Gerard comes up with it. On the run. Pass two defenders. Rolls it up on the rim. Got it to fall. Gerard. P.J. Hall ran into one another. Yeah, they, well, he. <laughs> All the way to the basket again for Gerard. Hall got it. Second chance. Over the shoulder. Into the basket to the free throw line. Well, how about one Joe Girard turning into a driver in the second half, and this is a much better use of P.J. Hall's time here. Beetle. Clark over the top with the follow. And a foul was called. Front court that Clemson has out there. Look, everybody caught watching the ball for NC State right there. Only seven field goal attempts in the first seven and a half minutes for NC State. Gerard to Godfrey going on a rim bender for the Tigers. Gerard, nifty little pass to RJ Godfrey. Taylor. Shot clock is at 10. Stepping back. That's for a three for Taylor. Critical three for the pack. Horn fires away and knocks it down. 7 0 run over the last minute and a half for NC State. Hall back and down in the paint. Basket and foul. PJ Hall. Let's play man on man with Diara inside. And on a, you know, on a lot of occasions, he's done the job, but uh, man. 14 points for him. Gerard leads with 21. 14 for Horn and Burns. This is Horn. Hanging and scoring, DJ Horn. Points in our contest. What a cut and what a find by.
Horn's got 20. Horn's got 23. Taylor's had a nice game with 12 points. He would like that one back. Gerard spins and hits. Tigers have won six in a row in the series, seven of the last eight. Furious comeback by NC State here in the second half after leading by four. O'Connell driving and scoring. NC State has a one here in Clemson, South Carolina since March of 2015. They've got five on the shot clock for Horn. A runner, he hits it, and he puts the pack in front. 78-77. Coming up the court is Hunter. Trying to beat the clock. He drives. It bounces out. O'Connell has it. Flings it ahead for NC State.